Hello and welcome to Technology Simplicity YouTube channel. My name is Jaytro, and today the topic is about how to use your WordPress the other simplest way to use the 100% free plugin to have and host your own podcast page. So the method is very simple, just you know install one of the plugin and upload your audio file and then when I say so simple you might like ah really yes I understand that you can actually upload and boost your podcast to many many other channels like Apple Podcasts, Spotify Podcasts and there are many more but what if you want to have your own podcast and your own website using the WordPress is one of the easiest way to host your own podcast so let me show you how to do it let's go Okay, once again, and let me repeat, if you have a, your WordPress website, okay, especially tools that you have self-hosted and you can install your own plugins, well, it's your lucky day. I'm going to show you the plugin that I use and how to do it. It's 100% free and you can create your podcast, podcast page easily. Okay, let's go. First of all, go to WordPress plugin. I'm going to show you. Okay, you're just going to search podcast and of course you can do it if you add your WordPress backend as well and there are quite numbers of podcast tools here okay there's a plugins but the one that I use yes it's called serious okay actually it's seriously simple podcasting this guy okay look for this I think it's a wave ways okay um, this guy seriously simple podcasting Podcasting, I'm sorry, by Castles, they have about 30,000 plus active installation and it tested to the latest WordPress version as well. So let's see. Okay, go to your plugin and of course add new and install. Once you have this, you shall see another menu called Podcast here. Okay, just click on it. There are few things you need to do is assuming you have a series and you have a lot of episodes this is where you actually upload one by one right okay if you go to the setting it's pretty straightforward okay for me i don't do anything here and if you look at the player for me the location i want it in the full content and i want it to be above the content content means the write up the articles you know like the blogs as, as usual and if you want to make sh make your podcast is limited to members only, you can always choose this guy. But for me, I want to be public, so I click uh, you know everybody as. And and why I I take this guy also is because I want the SEO much more friendly for the podcast that I actually uploaded. Especially the audio file that I created actually have a lot of metadata inside, and yeah. I want to, it to be more SEO friendly. I would truly suggest that, that you take this guy. Oops, let me go back. And I want to show the subscribe URL and I want to use this HTML5 player with album art. Okay, and it's a dark mode. And the rest of the thing is really up to your preference. Okay, it wouldn't, it wouldn't uh, you know, affect anything. Then it just on the fit details is um, usually. When kind of podcast, people can actually subscribe to your feed to actually get notified whenever you actually upload a new episodes. So this is the podcast RSS feed. Okay, this is actually how you customize it, and it's really up to you. Like with anything, that's all, ah, okay, and so on. Um, security wise, I don't think there are any things unless again, if your podcast is exclusive to your users need to log in then only you have to put out stuff and as well as you want to um, you know broadcast to somewhere else okay publishing wise um this is about whether you want to push push to somewhere else hosting wise um yeah if you want to host your podcast audio at somewhere else because imagine there are a lot of people actually trying to listen to your podcast at the same time so it's all about your hosting your bandwidth so if you're the host it somewhere you can use this Castos platform okay because this is this part is actually created by Castos okay import is more like um, you want to import 
is actually somewhere else so you want to import your podcast series to your website okay extension wise more like you, you want to have other features like you want to for hosting you want to have the statistics and so on okay you can browse this through okay let's go to the episode let me show you uh, okay uh, let me check one more time the option is actually where you want to distribute for example i'll distribute to google apple as well as spotify and stitcher okay it's simple as that and okay let's go to episode what you're going to do is just create new for me i already created one put your title put your content you know if you have a series you can create it for example i want to put uh, technology simplicity audio series that's why it's perfect okay then it's your audio and then you upload your mp3 file or m4a also can then you put up the episode image and i will actually always recommend it that your episode image always in the square because most of the thumbnail that you show in other podcast area as well as when you want to share out this link the thumbnail is access in the anywhere for example like whatsapp or even facebook the thumbnail is actually going back to the square space so make sure it's 300 by 300 px yeah it's square most importantly then you put up some information that you want and when it's done you can write the excerpt excerpt is something like summary okay when it's done it's very simple you just get this link and voila your patch is done okay my first episode of yeah blah 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 okay this is just example and this is the blame guys okay remember just now the setting you actually allow user to download the file or not is up to you okay for me i just leave it there so can listen to the uh, you know the podcast you can even open a new window it's up to you and so on and, and of course the wordpress built-in one of the built-in things is called command you can actually disable if you want and so on so it's so simple right surprisingly that simple okay that simple yes this is why the plugin is called seriously simple podcasting It's that simple. Okay. Coming back here, I already show you how to use a simple plugin called Seriously Simple Podcasting. Okay, it's hundred percent free. And I've been using it for months, and most importantly, is you have thirty plus thousand active installation. Means there are a lot of people are using them, and so far it's so good, and it's really simple to use. Okay, you know need to be so complex like you need to learn a lot of settings and so on and just be careful when you want to upload a huge audio file for example is your your talk show it could be one hour plus or 45 minutes okay if you put up to the website and remember one more thing okay and i keep emphasize the playing of the podcast is not about the software it's about the whole thing it's about your bandwidth it's just like okay imagine your hosting is just like highway if your highway has five lanes which means there are five concurrently user can access and listen to your podcast at the same time because listening to podcast basically is streaming directly so the user is actually downloading your audio file part by part and continuously so definitely it's about hosting it's about your bandwidth okay so if your hosting is good enough so you don't need to worry anything but if your hosting is not good enough that's why i recommend that you do host it somewhere else like the kratos account that you saw just now okay you can browse through there are many many more okay if you do have any questions you can put it in the comment box i do my best to reply to you and share with you how i actually tackle it as well as bandwidth thing and the hosting okay and so far i already shared with you how to use the simplest way to share your podcast in WordPress web page. If you like the whole idea about these tips and tricks and so on, please do me a favor, put a like on this video, subscribe to my channel as well as put a ring so that you get notified whenever I share and upload such a tutorial and tips and tricks again. And of course, every Wednesday at 15 p.m. I will my live, I'm going to share with you the latest trends and tips and tricks as well. 
Okay, thank you so much for watching and I hope you really enjoy what you hear and what you see and what you learn so far. And last but not least, during this pandemic time, please stay home, stay safe. Hope to see you again and bye-bye.